Ahoy, ye mateys! Welcome back to the 11th episode of my privateer playthrough. My friend Erin is joining me today. Last episode, we became crewmates with our former enemy, Redbeer. Now, because most of Captain Gunn's treasure has been lost, we are starting a new adventure to earn some gold. Captain Avery of Skull Island has sent us on a diplomatic mission to the governor of Puerto Mico. What was your reaction when you got Redbeard? <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm really questioning my judgment right now. <laughs> You learn later through the Redbeard promotion quest that he actually didn't mean to poison his old crewmates. Huh? So that made me feel a lot better. Yeah. <laughs> I had to go, it says, talk to Major Domo in Governor's Palace. Yeah, yeah, that's where we are. You have business with His Excellency? I trust you have a letter of introduction. Ah, let me see. These credentials are fine, but I cannot, alas, let you see His Excellency the Governor. At least, not dressed as you are. Ah, dressed like a savage. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so rude. I shall take pity on your plight to fabricate something acceptable in your city. Oh my 50, gosh, 50,000. 50, <laughs> Great. Now we have to take touch. <laughs> this is such a narrow talk with so many people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there is one of those ships. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm fighting the Santa Maria now. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> okay, Bernardo, fix us Ah, here is the silk. No doubt my competitors will miss it dearly. <laughs> I took the liberty of making this suit while you were gone. It will fit, don't worry. I delivered it to the governor's palace. You must be here for your suit. It certainly took you long Here it is. Oh, I leveled up. Oh, you look <laughs> we look so ridiculous. So close to <laughs> you proud? Good luck and <laughs> I can dress you properly, but I fear I well, never the... <laughs> I'm going to take a Why? selfie. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Why are we so tall? <laughs> That's right, body Ed. <laughs> You're very bold to come here wearing last year's fashion. A treaty. <laughs> last year's oh, fashion. Fascinating. I shall give it all due interest and respect. Do you have a gift? I'm honored. This chalice is uh, very fine, I'm sure. Ah, I see now. You are expecting to see Governor Ortega. Whoops. Wow. <laughs> He was declared a traitor to the realm and sealed in a dark pit. So sorry. I feel like he's the I evil guy. He has you, to be. My <laughs> my attention. I shall consider your treaty closely. The major domo will have my answer. I assure you, he will never sign your treaty. Your gift was an embarrassment, to say the least. But there may be something else you can offer in return for I so know good. who you are. You're the pirate who robbed the Presidio. <laughs> Seek out Bishop Hidalgo in the cathedral. He may have an offer that will interest you. Whoa, this, this is a really beautiful cathedral. Huh. Greetings, child. I trust you are not here to pray. A task must be done, vital to the crown. The islands of this cluster are covered in ancient... Nobody knows who they were or what they were doing, <laughs> but they left a legacy inlaid in the living rock of their temples. Gold. The gold we cry from these wounds makes us wealthy and powerful. Bold Marquisadors led the conquest of Skull Island, but one name outshines all the rest. Gortez. Oh. <laughs> Cortez embarked on his latest adventure. I am asking you to follow him into the very heart of the Isle of Doom. Do not be afraid. 
the island is named after him. <gasps> discoverer, uh, Baron Ferdinand von Doom. Who was unfortunately oh my gosh. by a giant snake. <laughs> I hear the island is a very pleasant place. As long as you avoid the swarms of friends, <laughs> trees, plants, and the uh, savage frog tribes with poisonous skin. I have no doubt you'll do very well there. Cortez was drawn to the Isle of Doom by rumors of vast treasures on that shadowed island. At first, Cortez was triumphant, as always. He and his troops cut a swath into the jungle, crushing all who opposed them. Gold poured out of the jungle, more gold than ever before. But in the months that followed, disquieting rumors reached us here. Cortez, they said, had lost his way. <laughs> Four months ago, all contact was lost with Cortez and his army. Their fate was not known until a conquistador came staggering out of the deep jungle. He said Cortez had built a kingdom for himself in the jungle. He'd also found something wondrous. The gold monkey. A treasure beyond reckoning. You must act where our strongest cannot. Go to the Isle of Doom. Find Cortez and bring him and this gold All monkey right. to the governor. Succeed, and I will sign your treaty. <laughs> they were like, we have to dress the danger up there, <laughs> except for flesh eating plants, carnivorous bees, and you know, poisonous <laughs> frogs, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> and we have to dress up again. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, oh, where is this tiny house? Oh, <laughs> how do we get through that door? I don't know. <laughs> The scurvy dogs and the hungry fish make the place too difficult for most ships to approach. When you sail there, I ask you to take these food supplies to the gold miners. They've been cut off for weeks. You'll be a hero to them. I think I'll just board your ship. <laughs> 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 ah, this is so pretty. It's so nice to be on your ship. <laughs> Watch out for the jellyfish. Oh, group plunder! Wait, how do I get up the steps? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Yeah, Wreck of the Skull Island and Sudden Squall. Nice. I wonder if we can trade the balloons. Thank you, Saints. You are here. We've been so long without good food. We were up. It's really pretty. Welcome, Captain, to the Isle of Doom. Don't it's drink the water. Let's see if you can avoid the parasite. <laughs> Don't drink the water. You came to find your death? We used to send search parties looking for it, but now we have other problems. Our water mole laborers are revolting. Uh oh, labor disputes. Oh. They may be short and <laughs> stinky, but they're hardly as bad as all that. No, I mean they are in revolt. They're attacking us. Can you help us? <laughs> Punish these rebels and defeat Haku, their leader. And I'll tell you what I know. Oh, some birds. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, here they are. <laughs> <laughs> I still have no idea what um, what type of damage to do on privateer because like all the in school stuff is support stuff, mm. so then people have to pick either a witch doctor secondary or like a melee secondary or musketeer. I haven't decided. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's gonna take a while to decide. What the heck is Haku? No idea. <laughs> <laughs> this place is pretty. Oh, there's drowned zombies in here. This is so creepy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Too late to help them 
monkey lords. Soon the old ones will rise. Which one is Haku? Oh, there he is. Um, oh, he's pretty far. He's in the yeah. Wow, they're really far. They are. <laughs> I guess this gives me time to buff. I'm just gonna move myself. And <laughs> 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 these are my two buccaneers. <laughs> <laughs> So apparently there was a discussion on Pirate 101 about whether or not this quest is racist. <laughs> because we're like helping, you know, the colonizers sort of. Mm -hmm. Wow, I'm still too far. Oh, I can't do any I'm still too far. Wow. Okay, no targets in range. What? So then um one of the developers answers was that the Water modes are revolting not because it's like a slave revolt, but it's because they're under magical influence. <laughs> so. Oh. so I guess we'll learn more about that. Yeah. <laughs> Your iguana is so fierce. <laughs> There's my little pink elephant. <laughs> Whoa, that did that so did much! <laughs> How are you so OP? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh no! <gasps> Whoa! Oh my goodness. Oh, That's no. a lot of damage. <laughs> it was. All in on him. Am I in range to heal? Okay, yeah. Oh, uh, now we have to defeat the mummy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so ironic using an undead spell to defeat an undead. <laughs> the old ones have failed Haku and his people. We will make peace with monkeys. Um, okay. <laughs> well then. <laughs> ah. I will give you gold for this out of my personal share. I will also help you on your dark mission. Why is our mission a dark mission? God damn. I met him once. I don't know what has happened to him. There are dark mission. in these jungles that apes were not meant to disturb. The gold monkey? It is a statue of a solid gold, taller than a tree, an amazing find. But I hear that it is cursed. I can put you on your path, his armor, but nothing more. But be careful. That's Drogi country, and the Drogis. Don't let their looks fool you. They are not kind to trespassers. Huh, okay. Into the dark jungle we go. <laughs> <laughs> the outpost! It's gone! Now what do we do? Oh my gosh. The Trogies made short work of this place. Let's look for signs of survivors and where they might have gone. Link to cave southeast of here. Send help. That's it then. Criado left us this note. Let's go and find that cave. Oh dear. I wonder if they're all dead now. <laughs> you have found us! We are saved! And it's only you? You are not here to rescue us? This is bad. Very bad. We are doomed for certain. Why are you here? Cortez! He sees us here, but the way is blocked. Swarms of bees let no one pass. The gold monkey! It is a wonder, a great tapestry of metal thread, hung with thousands of gold plates and countless emeralds. It is with Cortez. We are trapped here. Between the bees and the Trogis, Criado may yet live. 
If you hurry to the Draghi village, you might save him. I thought they said the gold monkey was a statue. How come that guy says it's a tapestry? I'm confused. The arrow's near here, but look at this. Troggy footprints headed to that cave, and I set a little bootprints among them. Death has not taken a little bootprints? Yet. Let's go save mm. him. Oh, oh, cause he's a little, little monkey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the sacrifice cave. Ooh, who are sacrificing? <laughs> <laughs> They're probably gonna sacrifice Criado. <laughs> oh, this is so pretty. Oh, it is. This place looks haunted. Whoa. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> we should probably say <laughs> Oh, we have to... Oh, we have to fight the Troggies to get to the fires? It's an epic fight. Whoa, epic battle. Okay, who are they? They have a mixed team. You use... Complete... Oh, we just need to reach the bonfires, I see. Oh, they use the bonfires? Um, I guess you could just start attacking them. Oh, okay. Things actually do quite a lot of damage. Oh, so now we have to defeat all the enemies. Okay. Man. Whoa, what was oh, that? Oh, he just took health. <gasps> oh! Whoa. Ooh, okay. He's actually pretty. He's getting difficult. <laughs> yeah. So basically, we have to take out. The teammates, so he can't heal back. Huh. <laughs> this is actually kind of a challenging fight. Look at my rat beard's health. <laughs> <laughs> look at how many people are attacking. <laughs> oh, look how bad. Oh my gosh, he dodged it. What? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, fine. Yes. Oh, my goodness. You have saved me from a fate worse than death, stranger. How can I repay you? You seek the gold monkey? It is an amazing thing. A great See, you know he said it's like a beacon. A made of polished gold, shiny in the heart of darkness. <laughs> what is this gold monkey? Is it a, a beacon, a statue, or a tapestry? Subdue drogies and take the poison. Well, these are all just rumors. Um, drive the beast away. Yeah. Past them, Who really knows? Is messenger and the ruins beyond. I still say you should turn back. Woo! <laughs> Alright, we have to go now. Alright, see you! Thanks for questing with yeah, me. Yeah, this was fun. <laughs> Alright. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Today, we tried to help Captain Avery establish a treaty with Governor Ortega of Puerto Mico, but Ortega has been overthrown. The current governor, Medina, was rude to us, so we talked to the Bishop of Puerto Mico and learned that we might earn the governor's respect if we track down a lost general named Cortez. Almost a year ago, Cortez had gone missing on the Isle of Doom. We are now on the Isle of Doom, and it's a beautiful but dangerous place. There are gold miners here deep in conflict with the local Trogis. 
We were able to help some of them and we are hearing lots of different rumors about what happened to Gortez. Stay tuned, leave a like if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching!